Hey, hey, Max Ignatius Atlas, day 70, year of change, change your perception, change your life. Everything from today's in the blog link below, be sure to check it out, look forward to hearing from you. If you make a choice, then you've got to stick with it. You see, we only get one chance, one opportunity for each day. Once it's gone, it's gone. I mean, you can argue with me about the construct of time, multiverse theory, and non-linear time, but for the purpose of today, time only moves one way, and it moves forwards. We age, and our most precious commodities are the free ones. Don't aim for anything other than freeing your mind, because that is the only thing that is worth being free. Now, you ask me, how can you do that? Well, you can do that through love of others, love of yourself, respect of others, respect of self, and service to others, and service to yourself. Because through those deeds, not only will wealth come to you, wealth in all its forms and all its riches, now, no one's saying be taken for a fool. Absolutely not. Because that would in itself be sh freaking stupid. What you need to do is look at what you want to achieve. Look at what difference you can make to this world. And then set about doing it. What I would recommend is writing it down. Write down what you want, but be very, very specific. And then pop it away in a drawer. Remember it and work towards it. And then once a week, take that piece of paper out of the drawer and write down how and what you're going to do to achieve it and keep those ideas coming and keep working towards it with all your strength. What you reap, you will sow. Remember that throughout time, this knowledge has been known and throughout time, it has been used by very few for great and unbelievable successes that have put mankind forwards and helped us grow as a species. Be the inventor of the next light bulb. Now, I'm not saying that's going to be me. I've no idea where my year of change is going to take me. What I want is a healthier life, a healthier body, healthier mind, and I want more time to pursue the activities that I love. And let me tell you what I love. I love my family. I love being with my family and ultimately I've already reached a very, very lucky life with all the free things that are bestowed upon me. But where I miss out is time because I need to sacrifice 50 hours a week, give or take a couple of hours working for a living just to pay the bills and keep a roof over my head, which is fine but I want to be a writer. I certainly want to help others. And most of all, I want to help myself because by helping myself and being accountable and responsible, then I can use that to help other people. And I would implore you to do the same. Look at what service you can be. Look at what you can offer. Look for gaps in the market. Look for ideas products and th options that will improve other people's lives while also improving your own. And if you do that, you will be one of life's winners. Thank you for listening, guys. Day 70. Be sure to check it out. Be sure to comment below. Stay healthy. Respect. Max. Out.